I've been to Plum Island for two reasons. First, uh, my daughter works there, so I went out on family day and got the tour of the whole island, which is fabulous. And then I also uh, uh, conduct uh, some uh, research business. Uh, I have uh, research collaborators uh, on the island. And Nick uh, worked for me and he's doing a master's, so he was just a natural candidate to go out there and see about doing a PhD. I mean, a lot of people aren't really jumping out of their seat to work with pigs. Um, just the inherent stench to it is kind of repul or, um, <laughs> repulsive to some people, I guess, but um, it's something I'd never done, so I, you know, I was interested in trying new things. Get a feel for what it would be working like in a, in a containment facility such as Plum Island. Even though some of their research was over my head, they, they dumbed it down if they had to. Um, you know, they were patient and uh, helped me get through it and understand everything. Nick came to me as an undergraduate uh, pre-veterinary student. Uh, we have some uh, fairly intensive uh, projects which require lots of hands. And so this is always an opportunity for, for pre-veterinary students uh, to get involved in research and at the same time uh, help out. It's important for the students. I think it's going to give them opportunities that they would not normally have and it would give them opportunities that they probably couldn't find in any vet school in the country.